know your throat's not feeling too good. No. But you're going to tell us about turn cornmeal. Yes, I'm going to do turn cornmeal today. Uh, it's a basic Jamaican traditional meal. You either eat it as it's on its own or you can use it as a side with steamed fish especially. I'm going to put my twist on it by adding bacon to it. When I was growing up, my mother would just fry up some corn, um, salt pork and put in it when we do have it. <coughs> we have it on a day when things are not so good. It's a tough day, so we would have it on that day. Okay? <coughs> so I'm going to start with the turn corn meal. I'm going to saute some bacon or fry some bacon. And it's not very lean, so it will certainly imitate the um, sauce pork. In this bowl, I've got tomato, scallion, and onion chop. I'm going to add it to the bacon. Salt, pepper, black pepper, and thyme. I took the leaves off the stalk of the fresh thyme and I'm going to add that to it. Here I've got two cups of coconut milk. I use the canned coconut milk and you might have to add about an ounce of, or two ounces of water to bring it up to two cups. Give the, <coughs> the, such a, the coconut milk and the seasoned a chance to come to a boil. In the meantime, I'll add a cup of cold water to the cornmeal. Because you have to make it a little bit liquid to add to the boiling liquid in there or else it will lump. And you don't want lumping. I'm adding a quarter teaspoon of pepper sauce. Scotch bonnet pepper, pepper sauce. We need a little scotch bonnet flavor. After the pepper sauce, I'm going to add a tablespoon of margarine or butter. This happened to be margarine. This is the cornmeal with water. And we do this so that when we add it to the boiling liquid in the, in the saucepan, it won't lump. Mind mm -hmm. you, we've got to stir fast as we go along. Here's the turned cornmeal. I'm just leaving it so to make sure that the cornmeal get cooked. So you just keep turning on a low fire, low on um, fire, a low on low heat for about the most ten minutes after adding it to the liquid in the pan. In the pot, saucepan. And how do you know when it's done? Will it taste it and you can tell whether the meal is, is cooked or not. It doesn't taste floury or grainy. The grainy it will because it's cornmeal. Mm -hmm. So here we have it. And to those of you who have been asking for it, here is Jamaican turn cornmeal. Very good, very tasty. Now, all you have to do is go to my website, Cook Like a Jamaican, and you get all the information you need. And enjoy and let me know. Now, you remember you can serve it with steamed fish, fried fish, I like it with fish, or any meat that you have, if you have meat cooked already, and some veggies, whether it be salad veggies or cooked veggies. Okay, and enjoy and let me know how you did.